okay to not drag this out we'll just make a very simple like title here and maybe i'll take the overlay Control c Control v make it smaller and maybe turn it around if you hold your shift key you can turn it around mm, like this okay and we would have another very beautiful overlay what i would do i would lower the transparency because i would like to bring the colors like more forward and this would be a very beautiful box for our title i wouldn't do anything like specific else here i would just go to insert text box let maybe make make the text box here autumn magic this would be my like my example thought process here and right now it's completely ugly so what do you want to do with this text maybe center the text maybe and that's not maybe make it bigger let me extend this box i'll place it in the middle and definitely you would like to have a white color or yeah i think we have a, a need to, a white because i would like this to be better visible now i'll just open my fonts and i'll select a bigger and bolder font and it's up to you which font you would like to use mm, in my case this will be all our display but i believe this is a font i downloaded and installed so let's maybe go for something simple Arial black Arial black is really great okay brilliant sense perfect so we have this title with this beautiful box and with this overlay and this could be your very first example slide design and just on a side note later on if you design something um, let's me let's say that i have a new slide i'll delete everything you can copy certain elements ctrl c ctrl v in a matter of one mouse click let's just imagine that this would be my slide boom and the right side would be a title I can make the title in in a matter of seconds no matter where i need this gradient if i need the gradient on this side boom smaller bigger then you can select the text and this would be a perfect start for your slide design let's just ctrl c ctrl v this and just imagine and now here a picture and like in a matter of a few seconds i'm creating a completely new slide boom let's try to make it fit here format crop and you don't have to replicate this i just want to show you a thought process of creating another slide which will be consistent with the previous design we did here and that's the beauty of powerpoint i can now ctrl c and ctrl v and now for example i would have another slide with the picture here on the left left uh, bottom side again i would go to picture tools i would hit crop i would crop this out and this is how I would move forward. Let's say that I'm creating a video and I will have some text here, some text here. Of course, the proportions are completely out of sync now. This is too small, but I wanted to show you how in a matter of like one minute, I can create additional slides based upon the same ideas and the same coloristic. Okay, enough of my talk. I would like you to open up PowerPoint and try to create at least something similar and in my opinion, what we did here is pretty advanced, but I wanted to give you the chance to work on something like that. If you don't want to make gradients, just make one color, solid fill, normal boxes like this. This will also look beautiful, if not even better. So absolutely do not mind if you are struggling with something. I wanted to give you a like more difficult task in order to not limit yourself. Okay try to create something like this yourself and we see each other in the next section where we will talk about animation